You're watching this because you want to overcome your addictions and restore your motivation. Let's get right into it. Some try to. We live in a world that is designed to stimulate our emotions. Every food product, ad and social media post is geared to give us a short rush of pleasure, which is followed by a craving for more. Big companies are able to leverage our cravings and make trillions of dollars by keeping us in a loop. Studies show that on average people use their smartphones for about 3 hours per day. That's 45 days in a year. Thankfully, there is a way to regain control over your impulses and take your power back through a practice called dopamine fasting. Dopamine is a brain chemical associated with wanting. That's why the first bite of chocolate feels amazing. A few bites later when the dopamine regulates, you start thinking about the next thing on your agenda. However, with video games, porn sites and social media, your brain always has the next thing to be excited about because they are engineered to trigger constant dopamine release. That's where dopamine fasting comes in. Dopamine fasting is the idea that if you avoid dopamine stimulating activities for extended periods of time, you'll be able to reset your brain and let go of addictive behaviors that negatively impact your life. Dopamine fasting exploded in interest in October 2018 and gained even more interest a year later after Dr. Cameron Seppa published an article on Medium titled The Definitive Guide to Dopamine Fasting 2.0. So, what is the science behind Dopamine Fasting 2.0? Well, it's based on Cognitive Behavioral Therapy or CBT. CBT is an evidence-based practice and prescribed by thousands of professionals worldwide for changing behavior. How does it work? Step 1. You need to identify the behavior that is causing your addictiveness. These are the common impulsive behaviors. Emotional eating, gambling and shopping thrill, internet and gaming, porn and masturbation, and thrill and novelty seeking recreational drugs. Step 2. You need to follow a dopamine fasting schedule. For example, let's say you want to reduce the amount of time you waste on your phone. You should refrain from using your phone for 1 to 3 hours every day, one day per week, one weekend per quarter and one full week per year. You should gradually increase these numbers and spend more time away from your device. This may sound easy on paper, but addiction is an extremely difficult thing to overcome, so here are some tips that will help you successfully do dopamine fasting. We'll talk about routine and reward replacement. Every time you drink the Coke you feel bad afterwards and end up gaining weight. Instead of drinking a Coke every day, you try to only drink a Coke every two days. Imagine that you have a bad habit of going to the local market to buy a Coke every day, but you find this difficult. Here's what you can try instead. Number 1. Identify the behavior. The behavior in this example is getting up, walking to the local store, buying a Coke and drinking it. Number 2. Identify the reward you're craving. A craving drives our behavior and rewards are what satisfies a craving. Start asking yourself why did you want Coke in the first place? Are you thirsty or do you actually just want a sugar high? Or do you just want to go outside? Start experimenting with 4 to 5 different rewards. One day drink a bottle of water and if after 15 minutes your craving has subsided, then it could be that you've just been thirsty but got into the bad habit of drinking a coke instead. On another day you might go for a walk to someplace other than the local store. If after 15 minutes the craving has subsided then it could be that you just needed some fresh air. Next step is to identify the trigger. After a number of days or weeks, Look for patterns to see which reward is the one you are truly craving. If you are thirsty, instead of drinking coke you can opt for an alternative like water or even organic juice. It will take some time to get used to but the key is to choose a healthy behavior that delivers a reward you are craving.